In this video, we are going to discuss making a multiple page website with Canva websites. Since we started posting all this Canva website content, we've gotten question after question about making multiple page websites on Canva, using hamburger menus on Canva websites, on desktop, etc. We actually talked to Canva directly and received this message telling us that they do not currently have a hamburger menu option for desktops. While that's kind of unfortunate and we hope that they come out with that feature soon, this video is a hack or a workaround to kind of make it look like your website does have multiple pages even though that's not an option when it comes to Canva websites. Another hack or workaround that we use quite often while we're talking about them is Later.com. We regularly use Later.com to schedule our content so we don't have to think about it week after week. We can just set it and forget it and schedule out a couple weeks to come. So if you're interested in trying our go-to scheduler, whether you use it once and then never use it again, but you get a bunch of weeks worth of content scheduled, our affiliate link is in the description below giving you 14 days free access to Later.com, which again, and it's another hack like the one we're going to discuss right now. We begin with our regular core website design in Canva and we assign names to each of the pages. Now, when we publish this website, we're going to be publishing it without navigation. As you can see here, we will be making a custom navigation menu. So we don't want the native Canva navigation menu as well, or we're going to have two of them. When you assign names to your pages on a Canva website, Canva provides a native menu option for the top of the screen. But when you click on those buttons, it's just going to scroll you down basically like a landing page. So this hack is giving us a workaround for how to go outside of that one page option. So we published our website without navigation, which means we're creating this custom navigation menu option. So you'll have to create that with some words and some links, create internal links on the menu titles on each page, and you simulate navigation within the site. Now you could just put this menu on the top of your website, but then people might have to scroll all the way up to use it. You could have this menu keep popping up on multiple pages as you scroll down, but it might look a little silly to have it popping up on every single one. So kind of pick your poison. You could also limit the menu options to make it a little more visually appealing. Maybe you just have two buttons or maybe they just look a little different. So it's not like the same like header text is just repeated over and over again. If you do decide to have it repeating on each page to save some time, when you add links to it for the first time, just copy that whole thing. You can group it together and copy and paste it on whatever pages you want. Now to get to the juicy part, to add a menu option that is separate from your current website. I mean, like you're not just scrolling down on the page somewhere. You can duplicate this core website, the whole thing, and remove those non-essential elements, non-essential pages, so that the rest of it can match your current site as closely as possible. This means that the menu navigation that you've created, that custom navigation menu, it stays the same. It's the same placement as your core website. The background's the same. Whatever you want to be the same is the same. Now, if you want it to look a little different, that's on you, design decision. You're gonna publish this separate page, whether it's a blog or a portfolio or whatever else you're highlighting on this separate website that looks the same as your core website. Publish that without navigation as well and then link it to your main site using the URL link you're provided by Canva. You can repeat this process for other pages as needed, maintaining this navigation structure and make sure above all to test the links out. Test every single link on every single page because you wanna make sure that your navigation functions smoothly and that people can go where they're trying to go. And if you need more Canva help, we're here for you. Join the hub or subscribe for the next video.